Hey everyone, this is my first tutorial I've done, so if I am a little rusty, just uh, let me know and um, enjoy. Anyway, this is going to be how to rig in Blender. Firstly, what you're going to want to do is um, have a model. Okay, so now I've modeled my character, but um, what you're going to want to do is you're just going to want to save it somewhere. And then also a great thing is using a uh, subdivision surface uh, modifier. It really helps bring that smoothness, you know. So then you're just gonna hit apply, if you want, I mean, just, I like doing it, so. I'm gonna move this up here, and then this is where it's gonna create the, um, the rig, so you're gonna say shift A, then you're gonna get an armature. You could do a human, but I'm gonna make this really simple, so click single bone, go up, go to um, the armature, say x-ray, so now you can see through it, and it's really helpful now. Uh, great. Now what you're going to do is to take the bones and um, and move them, you say E to extrude, so now you have like a couple bones, and now you're going to have one, you're going to select one of these, and then you're going to say shift E, and then you're going to um, move that out like that, you're going to do the same thing this side, so shift E, then you're going to select both of these, and go E to extrude, and then you could use this, um, the, the sizing thing, just go like that, and extrude again, and do that. Then you can use this. Go Shift E, um, and then you can also go Alt P, and then say Disconnect Bone. Move it along here, go like there. This really basic rigging tutorial. I mean, you know. Okay. So then go E again, and then what you can do is you can just select these. Click um, click C, and you have this thing open, and then you just drag that, and then you can um, right click again, and then it'll deselect that. And then say I mean, Shift D. And then you'll duplicate that. R180. Rotation 180 degrees. And you go like that. Then click tab and go back into object mode. Then select your mesh. Um, hold and shift. Click on the armature. Control P. Then go to automatic weights. Cool. Cool. Okay. So now that it's with automatic weights, you can go into pose mode. And now. Now you have um, your mesh moving, but as you can see, it, it looks a bit funny, you know, <laughs> like over there with the, um, at the leg, it's moving in. So now what you do is you click on your um, on your mesh, go into weight paint, and then you can select uh, the different bones. And then over here, you what I use is subtract and add to subtract weight and add weight, and then you just move like that. Oh, um, let's click this thing. I don't know what it is, but eh, just yeah, it basically it does it so. You know, you, you can apply the same thing to the opposite side, so it's easier to use. Um, now you've got it looking more realistic, you know. I mean, imagine if you were, like, walking, and then your stomach moves just if your leg moves, like, a lot. So now you're just gonna select the different bones. Oh, you select them by right-clicking. Cool, that looks fine. Then just do this. I'm, I'm not doing a great job here, just for tutorial purposes. But um, you're gonna have to refine it quite a lot. Like you're gonna have to go into like the smaller details and go add and subtract quite a bit um, for it to look really good. But um, you know this is just tutorial, so there we go. There we go. And let's see this. <laughs> cool. So now you have that. Let's see this. Okay, that looks a bit funny. So now you're gonna go into add and a little bit of weight this side. A little bit of weight. Wait. A little bit of weight that side. Now let's just test this side. Okay, yeah, see, it has that again. So you're gonna wanna go to subtract. This is what I mean, like, you get into the nitty gritty sort of stuff, and it gets pretty boring, but it doesn't matter, okay? It's just, it's just a tutorial, just a tutorial. Um, cool. So that's how to rig in Blender. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little tutorial. Hope it was easy. Um, please subscribe, and have a great day. Bye.